And so the map month season begins. Let us go and find those legendary creators who deserve that fame and recognition. So the very first map of the month is Midnight Sorrows, at least for t for September 2019. Because if I click on the next one, it goes back to the 31st. So this has been selected. This will be the first map, unless it turns out to have too many enemies. Midnight Sorrows! Midnight Sorrows indeed! It's gonna be Assault and a Wild West and a Gameplay Modifiers of No Health Regen. I didn't really say that right, did I? Gameplay Modifiers, No Health Regen, Highlight NPC! Yes! Gunslinger, Ranger, Quiet Boy, a lot of weapons. That's not what the last loadout is, it's just called Modern Boy. Modern Boy, yep. I'm going to just roll a dice and let me determine... It's going to determine that I'm picking on Modern Day. So I'm a Modern Day... I thought I'd heard a Lost on Mars enemy for a moment. But no, nope, it's not. Okay, so this is just 25 enemies. Oh, they're going to keep players in the map. I kept stomping on some random hill there. The random hill's not there anymore. Now it's in the town. We're going to go in the town. I'm gonna go after the enemy. I'm gonna go after them. Oh, wait, am I close? No, I'm not. Um, I only get one silent weapon choice if I choose to use- What the hell are you doing, sir? I have no idea what you were looking at the ground for, but nevertheless, your time is done. Um, do I even want to use- I don't know. You know what? Fine, I'll keep my handgun for now. Oh, I found another handgun. And more more revolvers. Oh, this is like a cowboy theme. Okay. I should probably respect the cowboy theme then. Let's do it. I now have a revolver. This revolver is a much worse gun than I was using before. But it's a revolver. And now let's get started. This gun is crappy for aiming. Boom. I almost wish that I was doing an annoying game... Annoying roleplay thing, but I'm not doing that this video because I'm already doing something else That something else is just me playing the first map of the month Come here. Well, I suppose I could do both but nah It's too late now. I'm already invested in that the first impressions reaction is gone Because now I've seen this map and that douche is looking for me. He's looking for me <laughs> He's trying to look for me, and I'm just going to go around and play circles with him. I'm just going to play circles. I have to say, this map is somewhat enjoyable. It's pretty good as far as the gameplay goes. Boom. Finally got him. Random meadow field out there. Random meadows. Yep. You guys don't use revol- Oh, there's a scope on that. I don't want the scope. You guys don't use revolvers. I'll use his handguns. Well, that's okay, because I use a bat, so that works out. I'm breaking the rules, too, you know. I broke the rule. I'll use a bat. I use wooden bats. There's a dude there that kept shooting at me. These are all enemies on control zones. All of these enemies are on control zones. Okay, it's actually quite difficult to aim these, this revolver. It's quite difficult. Oh, uh, this mission would be so, so easy if I was actually using my other weapon sets. If I was actually using a real gun and not this revolver the entire time, so... Uh, I'm just kind of making it a challenge out of it. I generally have to do that, though, with Far Cry maps. Far Cry 5 maps. Because a lot of the maps are too easy. And it's... Some of it's not the creator's fault. There's a lot of it that still is, but it's not fully. The fault is, is that... There's not really any super-powered human in this game. They all die so quickly. The majority of them will go down in one or two blows. And the ones that don't go down in one or two blows are, well, well, they're pretty much not immune to takedowns. They can still be hit by a takedown. The only enemy that's going to take more than one shot to kill is Jacob. And he still goes down to a rocket launcher. So, to, to take that for what you will. Anyway, let's go find these other cowboys. Oh, that guy might have actually used a revolver. I don't know. I didn't pay attention. I did see there was another revolver on the ground, though. There was. 
And now we're entering the cemetery. There's gonna be a shootout in the cemetery. In the cemetery. As I aim at that guy and just do a headshot. Aim at that guy, do a headshot. They're trying to get me. They're trying. They're really trying. They're not gonna get me. See if I can aim at that guy, give a head, put a headshot. It's actually quite easy. Quite easy. But I just use the revolver this most of this mission. There's another revolver shot. Another revolver hit. Boom. Down. Gone. And now they're gonna give a sniper rifle, but I'm actually gonna stay with the revolver. I'm gonna stay with the revolver unless I die. Oh god, okay. I might actually have to switch after all. Might have to. I'm almost through the cemetery. I might be able to stealth my way through this part. Because it's pretty dark here and there's a lot of mist. If I can't stealth through, then I can at least get to a place of better cover. Because that's too far away from where I am. Random shovels, random items. Okay, now it just feels like it's really catering. It just feels like a huge cater now, finding all these guns. There's too many of these weapons. It's being too generous now. It's, it's oversharing. Hello. You have a shotgun. I can see your shotgun. Well, I'm just going to do a bunch of abdomen shots. Uh, just to put you down. And kind of disorient the enemy. Oh, that guy is actually hiding behind. Oh my god, I have piercing ammo. Let's use the piercing ammo. Yeah! I actually thought that they would shoot me if I ran across. Nope, they didn't. Okay, I'm going to go here. There's a guy there. Oh, now because I'm using piercing ammo, I think they're going to go down in one blow. They might. They might actually just go down in one blow now. Well, that's the beauty of piercing ammo. The beauty of piercing ammo. You have to actually hit them. Oh, he didn't go down in one blow. He's not dying, though. You know what? Fine. I'll just assume that their partners are not going to help them because they're kind of on control zones. Oh, their partner did help them. Well, their partner's going down next. You're next! Oh, now you're directly behind cover and I can't shoot them. I can't actually shoot them. Come on! There's an actual wall that was protecting him. Okay, I'm just gonna move on to a different target. Let's just shoot someone else. Like that guy right there. That guy. Oh, there's another guy over there. Oh, no, oh, I've been spotted. I've been spotted. Come on. I'm gonna wait. Actually, you know what? I'll go this way. I'll go this way. We're gonna go this, out, out this direction. I'm gonna sneak through the house. I'm probably gonna use my bat on this guy. Yep. He's gonna be hit by the bat. Oh, the a punch, a punch in the face and then my bat. Get my, 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 my bat. This revolver is doing wonders. As I missed that bullet. But I got that bullet. Now we'll see if anyone wants to help their friend. Does anybody want to help their friend? Or oh, oh, one person does. Somebody tried to. Anyone else want to help their friend? Anybody else? Huh? Huh? You want to go help your friend? You want to do anything? Yeah, you're trying to. Well, they tried. They tried to help their friend. This cowboy journeyness is almost done. It's almost done. I've almost made it to the end. Kaboom. Pretty good assault map, actually. I mean, the super hardcoreness in me is, is disappointed because there's so many catering weapons that they give, despite having no health regen turned on. The map would be a really easy if I had used any other gun besides the Magnum. But I'm currently looking at this from a different perspective. Because it's map month season, so I generally have to excuse certain things. And that one is definitely a good map, so I'm going to go ahead and give it a like. And now that I've done the very first map, I'm going to do the very second map. Kill or die! But it's a journey, so we might not actually have to kill at all. Kill or die. And now the games begin. Shota. 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 I guess that's Shota. Must be Shota. Pistol play. Sniper wolf. 
Empty is not actually empty. That is a lie. That is definitely a lie, sir. Screw you and your lies. How dare you lies. I don't want to know. No, that was a lie. Okay, well, I'm still driving the car, like I said. The mission is called Kill or Die, but I'm just going to drive a vehicle instead. Kill or Die! With a vehicle involved. There's a guy right there. There's a bunch of guys here. I killed. I haven't died yet. They died. I killed and they died. Does that count? I killed and they died. Get out of the way. Just get out of the way. It's a road raging town. Road rage. As I crash into this. And do the... Uh, oh, it's one of these maps. One of these maps of the... This is a type of map that kind of feels like, and I haven't gotten to the end, so I could be wrong about this. This is one of those maps that... Okay, yeah, I have gotten to the end. Uh, this is one of those maps, as I say that for the third time, that the creator expected people to shoot everyone right away. They made a decent looking map, but they faulted it when they put it on Journey, because in Journey, you don't have to kill anything to win. You don't actually have to kill the enemies. You can just run for the finish line and the game is over. That's it. The game's done. So my advice to the creator, change this to assault. That way people will actually look around in your town. As it sets right now, nobody has to look at anything. They can just go move on, get to this ending line, this finish line, and it's done. So... Change this to Assault, or you could change it to Bounty and place random targets in areas that you want players to explore. Because that means the players are going to have to go to that area if in order to win. They will have to go to that area if you set that Bounty target there. But anyway, that's my advice to you. Use it if you want, or ignore it. It's up to you. And that's going to be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Thank you so much, and I'll see you on the live stream later today. Goodbye!